find the least number which leaves remainders 11 9 and 7 when it divides 71 81 and 91 okay so uh, when we talk about the least number okay which leaves remainders 11 9 and 7 7 when it divides it divides okay so in the previous questions okay we were looking forward to numbers which were being divided okay but here in this question okay when it divides when it divides means the number we have hai that number is dividing 71 that number is dividing 81 and that number is dividing 91 okay now one small concept i would like to discuss that will make things very very easy for the upcoming parts as well okay now see if i have a number let's say 15 okay 15 ko let's say if i divide with 4 okay 15 ko if I divide with 4, 4 3s are 12. The remainder is 3. Okay, this tells you what 15 is 3 more than a multiple of 4, right? And that's exactly how we write this in this form. 15 is equal to 4 into 3 plus 3. Matla 15 mein se agar hum 3 nikal denge, you will get a multiple of 4, isn't it? Okay, so in the same way in this question, I can say that 71 minus 11 will be a multiple of the given number. So 81 minus 9 will definitely be a multiple of the given number. It means 91 may say 7 remove kia, I will get a multiple of the given number, right? So 71 minus 11 is 60, 81 minus 9 is 72 and 91 minus 7 is 84. Okay, so 60, 72 and 84 jo hai, ye sare us number ke multiples hai. Okay, so as a consul least number hoga jiske multiples yes are okay 60, 72, and 84. Ek as a number which is a common factor of these three and it is the highest, right? So we take the HCF. We take the HCF of these numbers 60, 72, 84. If you know tables 12 fives are 12 6 are 12 sevens are the answer will be 12. All right. Now many people ask me that the least number is asked. So many times it so happens that the people also consider factors of 12. Let, let's say factors of 12 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6. Okay. Now the problem with factors of 12 are if you divide the numbers 71, 81 and 91 with 1, 2, 3, 4 and 6. Okay. You will get remainders less than or equal to these factors. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 6. Okay. So remainder 11, 9 or 7 is not possible. Nahi hoga. Are you understanding this? Is we directly say that the HCF in this case 12, it is the required answer. Okay. So that's about it. The HCF model one, it tells you that general form of the number that leaves remainders X, Y, and Z when it divides A, B, and C, okay, it will be HCF of their basic differences, the difference of the divisor and the remainder. All right. So let N be the greatest number that will divide 1305, 4665 and 6905, leaving the same remainder in each case. Okay. Now uh, let's observe something. If I write multiples of 30, let's say I write uh, 60 and I write uh, 90 and let's say I write uh, 150 or multiples of 30. Okay. And uh, if you observe carefully, this is 30 into 260. This is 30 into 390. This is 30 into 5. 150. Okay. In some common number add kia two. Okay, they all will become 62, 92, and 152. Okay. Or the numbers are all of the form 30k plus 2, isn't it? Okay. So agar amlo dhyan se observe kare, okay. All these numbers, okay, 60, 90, and 150 when I derive from here. Okay, 60, 90, and 150, since they're all multiples of 30. Whenever you take the difference, the differences also are multiples of 30. Let's say, for example, 150 and 90, that is a difference is 60, multiple of 30. 90 and 60 itself is 30. Is that clear? So when I ask you, find the smallest number, okay, which leaves the same remainder when it divides 62, 92 and 152, what you will do is take the difference. Taking the difference, you land up with 30 and 60. You take their highest common factor. Okay, HCF of these two numbers is 30. Greatest number which divides all these three, leaving the same remainder is going to be 30. Okay, we'll apply the exact same logic in this question. Okay, the greatest number that divides 1305, 4665 and 6905. Okay, giving the same remainder. That same number will also be a factor of their differences. We studied just now, isn't it? So we take the difference. I want a number that basically divides both of these. They have 0, 0, 0, 
ओके थ्री थ्री सिक्स टू टू फोर एक सौ बारह राइट सो वन वन टू ओके देखो ना तीन गुना हो जाएगा तो क्या हो जाएगा इट्स ऑल अबाउट बिंग विद नंबर दैट्स ऑल सो थ्री थर्टी सिक्स बेसिकली इज वॉट वन वन टू इंटू थ्री टू ट्वेंटी फोर बेसिकली क्या है वन वन टू इंटू टू सो द हाइस्ट नंबर यू कैन टेक कॉमन इज वन वन टू एंड जो जीरो आपने कैंसिल किया वो भी डाल दो इसमें सो द हाइएस्ट कॉमन फैक्टर इज वन वन टू जीरो they are asking you the sum of the digits n okay we have found out the value of n n is the greatest number that divides all these three with the same remainder it is 1120 okay sum of the digits will be 1 plus 1 plus 2 which is 4 okay this is your hcf model 2 and that is the largest possible number with which if we divide a b and c then the remainders are same it is the hcf of any two of the difference